Hello and welcome to Catalon API testing tutorial from rcvacademy.com. This is brand new series of Catalon API test automation and in this series I'll start from very basic and will cover the concepts which are intermediate and then move forward to the advanced concepts of API test automation using Catalon Studio. Now before we get started, let's understand what exactly is Catalon Studio. So Catalon Studio is a free and robust test automation solution which supports your API test automation, web automation and desktop and mobile automation. So any desktop applications you can automate using Catalon Studio as well. The desktop sub automation support came into version 7.0 and above. So this is a recent addition to the Catalon Studio, but API web and mobile testing automation has been there for a while and it is built on top of the Selenium libraries. So if you have worked on Selenium already, it will be very easy to understand and use Catalon Studio for your web API desktop and mobile automation. Now the next important thing about Catalon Studio is that it is very easy for beginners to learn and start doing the automation. Not only for the beginners, it has good support and good extensions and customization capabilities. So if you are a very experienced person in automation, this tool is also very good for you because you can customize and utilize a lot of extensions that are available to make the uh, framework as per your needs. The next important thing is that it provides out of the box integration. So Jira integration is out of the box and then it also provides native integration with most of the popular continuous integration tools like Jenkins, Bamboo, Azure and CircleCI. So these are some of the uh, very key features of Catalon Studio. There is a lot more that Catalon offers and will understand what all features and functionalities are offered by Catalon Studio and then we'll start with the Catalon API testing. So let's go to the website catalon.com and see what all features are being offered. So here I am at the catalon.com and here as you can see that Catalon 7 solution has been released and that's when the desktop automation has been added. Now Catalon is a free tool, however, if you have the enterprise and you want to get the different products, so they have different pricing options available as well and uh, which you can get the details from the pricing section of the website and here you can see you have the Catalon Studio Enterprise Runtime Engine and the prices displayed accordingly. But if you want to start doing the automation free tool is good enough and has a lot of integration capabilities to start with uh, to get started with Catalon learning it and then uh, doing the automation end to end. Now in the product section you will see the Catalon Studio uh, test ops recorder Catalium. Uh, this tutorial series will be mostly for the Catalon Studio and totally focusing on the API testing using Catalon Studio. So if you go to Catalon Studio and see all the details and the functionalities provided by Catalon Studio, you can see that it has the capabilities of um, the CI CD uh, continuous integration deployment pipeline. Uh, it has a lot of integration with the Docker, AWS, Azure as well. And it basically provides you the lot of capabilities to uh, generate your automated test. You can do web testing, API testing, mobile and desktop app testing with the studio. And if we go to the resources, you will get a lot of user manuals, tutorials and tips. So here at the docs page, you can find a lot of information about the studio enterprise, runtime engine, etc. So we won't go through de these details as of now. So the next step is now we have uh, understood what exactly is Catalon Studio, what it does its tool to do the um, automation of web, desktop, API and mobile. So as part of this tutorial series, we'll be focusing on the API test automation using Catalon Studio. So let's go to the uh, products and to download Catalon Studio, you can simply say download now link and it will redirect you to 
the sign up page so you have to provide the details for the sign up so let's go and provide the details so on the sign up page you can provide the details to create your free account so i'll provide the details and if you have the business email provide the business email um, otherwise just use your personal email as well which i'll use and just provide the password so and click on get started and you'll get a confirmation email that we need to activate the license so once you sign up so after you provide the detail the next step is to give a little bit more detail so just select what you are automation tester IT engineer um, and then select the downloading so you have to choose one so you can select learn about automated testing or whatever usage you are looking for so i'll say learn about automated testing and click on download so as per form that you are on it will automatically start the download so now you can see that because i'm on windows 64 bit it has automatically selected that option you can uh, choose any of the platform that you want to download it for so i'll just leave it as a 64 bit and start the download so once the download has been finished for the catalon studio we'll start the installation of catalon studio on windows so while catalon studio is downloading let's understand what is runtime engine so runtime engine is the test execution add-on for catalon studio and this runtime engine allows you to um, execute your automation test cases in the command line mode as well as you can use runtime engine to schedule your test cases and then integrate with the continuous integration continuous deploy deployment uh, systems or you can bundle your test cases and then also execute in the containers like docker so runtime engine we won't download now we will download runtime engine once the catalon studio is downloaded we'll install it we'll go through the basic tutorial and intermediate intermediate tutorial first and then once we come to the ci cd pipeline and um, integrating catalon test cases with ci cd then we'll install runtime engine and start with the ci cd